Oh, so let's... I need the rocks back. Here. Thank you. Okay, build you. Then we can build a pitchfork. Cool, I... Shit. Far. Um, take my mandrakes. Just don't eat them. That would be bad. There we go. And you... I kind of put that in an awkward spot as far as, you know, digging stuff up goes. Here, take my axe, too. No! No, oh, I did not mean that. I did not mean that, my friend Chester. I'm so sorry. I did not mean to do that. It seems like he's okay with it. He doesn't really care. It's kind of a good guy like that. Thank you, Chester. You are, you are a gentleman and a scholar, and I thank you quite desperately for not turning around and raping me in the bone hole like you probably should have. There we go. And that's how we do that. Okay, we'll do it a little bit more safe this time. Okay, now let's expand this out a little bit. Perfect. And this is pretty much all the area I'm going to really need for anything. Okay, good. Um, tools. I can make a shovel. I can make a razor, but I don't see any point of that. I don't even have a beard yet. Okay, as far as refining stuff. Okay, we'll store the seeds in you. Store the poop in you for now and store the rose petals. Gonna need some room. Spear. Alright, I mean, we're living near the beefalo. We kind of need some weapons. Just in case, just in case. Refined papyrus. We can make a straw hat. Might as well make a straw hat. It's always good to have a hat. Now let's throw the fuel in here. God damn it, that's a big fire. I love that. Alright, and then from here on, might be a good idea to... Eat you. There we go. Okay. Thank you, Chester. You are the man with the plan, and you are helping me quite vigorously. All right. I do like this little guy. He seems he seems cute for as much as he freaked me out to begin with, and as um, <laughs> curious, so to say, as the bone is. Um, I don't mind his presence. I really don't. So let's go put. The logs, that, uh, we'll put the bone key over here too. Looks like night's already over. And we are on to day two. Um, I don't know what I was going to look for. Alright, let's go gather some poop. We just need to gather poop. I think that'll be the best use of our time. Unequip that so we don't actually attack anything tree over there just kind of died um yeah the good thing about this wormhole is we kind of have access to really two areas i mean the wormhole is literally just down there it's a it's a short walk and then from there we can go back up to here which that wormhole like leads to a road which is very quick travel which we can do that stuff over here I mean, go, we can go to those i do like this i do like this a lot this is this is nice this is nice. We got a shovel. Let's get you. Okay. So. Let's... Where's my axe? Ah, I gave it to Chester. That's right. Thank you. Start collecting some more wood. Hello, Beefalo. You don't seem like you're in the, the right spot. Seems a little... He seems a little out of place. Anyway, we're already up to day three. That's... Kind of surprising, actually. I didn't think time had passed quite that quickly. Not that I can really complain, but still. Err, to you too, my friend. All right, click the manure. He's just dro he's just dropping it everywhere. Okay, I've actually kind of have a plan. Um, going a little bit off what I've done previously with the walls in that last one. Maybe not quite as serious. Um seriously overboard with the with the uh with the, the walls but i kind of have a plan kind of similar to what i was doing with those and I'm, I'm, I'm hoping it'll work and i don't know if it and i don't know if it will i really do hope it will it's kind of a let's actually kind of explore a little bit around here we don't really specifically need a lot yet we've got food in chester we've got plenty of supplies to last us for a little bit um 
And as long as I play things right and I don't do stupid shit, I shouldn't die. It's only day three. I just scared myself with that bird because I'm like, I shouldn't die. And whenever I say something like that, something bad happens. Always. Always it happens. Something bad happens. So, eh, we'll mark it about there. Just me and Chester kind of bonging along. Oh. Ah, there we go. There's a wooden thing. Box thing. I don't know why I'm calling it a wooden thing. I guess because it looks like it's a wooden thing and it's a thing and that's all I really give a shit about. So neat. And no, I, I don't know, like... It seems kind of... To me, it seems kind of suspicious that I'm finding these things so easily when... You know, in the last playthrough, hello house, this is where a pig lives, and there's the pig. Now, my best guess is that means there are going to be more pigs nearby, not too terribly far off, because they usually, they usually aren't reclusive. But, what do I know, that's a swamp, we're going to avoid that. We already learned the dangers of those, and even being this close is a little bit more edgy than I want to be. I don't even want to be near that spider thing. I don't want to die. I don't want Chester to die. That'd be terrible. He's cute and fluffy and all just kind of sorts of nice. I don't know why he should die. He's a good little man. A good little man indeed. Now I'm on a carrot real quick. Just get that out of the way. Now, see, there's another pig. Like, they don't... Like, they don't... I don't remember them living on their own. Hey, there's another butthole. I don't know if they actually use, like, it actually takes time to travel through them. I had no idea what I was just hearing. I thought I heard something sniffing, and, um, that's always very suspect to me. I, I don't know. Sound like, I am very, very, very suspicious of all noise in this game. I, I kind of have to be. So there's another pig. I'm half tempted to kill him. To be honest, I mean, seems the best thing to do. I mean, they don't need to live. They don't need to live. I get this. Ah, perfect timing. Okay, well we got plenty of stuff here. Start making our way back to our home. Can also follow the ocean over here, just to kind of get a good idea of the size of the area that we're in. Hmm. I'm always curious about the actual... Like, to me, I feel like the map being complete... Like, like how quickly you can see, like, get areas of the map viewed is just a little bit slow to me. And I honestly find that, uh... I'm on the other side of the river. Hello again, pig house. Goodbye again, pig house. Um, that how quickly you explore the map is a little slow. Um, I mean, that's not, that's not really a big, it's not really a big issue. It's really not. It's, I, I just do find that, um, actually exploring, especially as with as many times as I've played through this now, um, the first time, and then the second time on camera, and then once, quote unquote on camera, not really, because fuck the X story sometimes. I feel like maybe having the map be explored a little quicker would be a little bit more, I don't know, fun. It might take away a little bit of the quote-unquote challenge. But I'm going to be honest. I don't give a goddamn about the challenge in this game. I mean, it's nice, don't get me wrong, to have a challenge, but... 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. I'm going to need 13 pieces of grass. Okay, and that's also him doing that little <laughs> thing. That's 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 nice. You scared the shit out of me, guy. You you happy with that? Also, let's put these back down. Let's dig these up. This will actually probably be the right amount. Cause what I I actually have something planned for what I want to do, and a certain look I want it to have. Also, we need to make our way back to the house. Because we're actually uh, running a little low on time. And I actually could not remember how far away the house was. I thought it was a little bit farther away than that. And we'll throw a log on there. 
Okay, now let's see what else we can make now that we are here. Going to need a few more things to make the alchemy engine. One more of those, one more of those. There he is. Need two more of both of those. And then there we go, now we can make it. I'm so hungry. We'll place it right here. Alright, now let's sit... I have no more logs. I did not want to use you on pine cones, but it looks like I'll have to. Except I have more pine cones on him, never mind. He also has some poop on him, I'm gonna have to start coagulating these. I like that. There we go. Let's open up Chester. Let's kind of get our inventory a little bit more straightened up. I also have the savannah grass I could use, and I'm planning to dig up more of it. I probably could have used those instead of the pine cones, considering I just said I wanted to have pine cones. But whatever. So I'm going to need 13 pieces of grass. Um, what I'm... What I... Okay, I, I'll go ahead and spoil it, because, I mean, it's not really that big of a deal what I'm trying to do. What I'm going to try to do is have, like, the little 9 by 9 area that I kind of usually have. And uh, surround that by this, this kind of grass, and then put trees and walls around it as kind of protection. Oh, it just seems it just seems like a cool idea to me. I don't know. I'm weird. Fuck you. Okay, and then we'll also... Okay, wow. We just fucking killed that butterfly. I did not want to kill that butterfly. I'm not that big of a jackass, I'm sorry. Alright, dig you up. And there we go. Okay, that should be enough. At 16. Yeah, and this will also give us some more savanna turf to burn. And then eventually, I guess, we will, um... Yeah, so this is right. Okay. So we'll dig this up. We'll also pick that up here in a minute. And we'll throw that inside chest. And we'll also use that as fuel for the knights. We're already on, we're only on day four, so we should be doing pretty good as far as all, all things considered. Hello, bird. You scared me once again. I thought I, I was going to die. I don't know why. I'm really jumpy for some reason. I feel like it... I, I keep thinking it's... It, it, it was called Adventure Mode. I keep thinking that things are going to be much more, like, random when it just seems like it's more or less the same. Not that that's necessarily a bad thing. I was just expecting it to be different, I guess. Not that that's not not that that's bad that it's not. I mean, it's this is a good game regardless. I really do enjoy Don't Star for all its for all its bullshit. But I don't know. There we go. Fix that little graphical bug right here in fucking now. All right. So there we go. We got that. It's a nice. I don't know, it just looks cool. And then we'll put in the middle, like, wood flooring or some shit, because I'm pretty sure we can do that. I've not, I've not really checked 100%, but I'm pretty sure we can do that. Don't, 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 uh... Don't count me on that, because I'm not 100% sure, but I think so. I think so. Okay, so we'll get... Pine cones from you. And then we'll place them at the four corners. That's kind of going to be our starting points. Neat. Have all this inner area for ourselves. I love it. I love it. Okay, cool. We could probably also put one. We won't do that, not yet. So put that thing in there. Okay, then. Alright, so the next thing that we need to start doing is. It is adventure mode, so we probably do need to actually be exploring around a little bit more than we normally would, but. There's that butthole over there, but I'm not going to have enough time to do that today, as in this day, as in the in-game day. So let's actually... Hold on. There we go. And then we'll store that over here. I forgot actually how much space we really do have. We need to collect more wood, by the way. We're going to need a lot of wood. We also are going to need a lot of pine cones. We're also eventually going to have to find a